used to be a recommendation is now the law in New York State. All kids under the age of two must be buckled into a rear-facing car seat. News Channel Line's Adrian Smith shows us what that means for moms and dads. Keeping young passengers safe, something Jessica Salisbury and Alexis Graham strive to do with their own children. I'm not an expert, but I plan to, you know, follow the law because if that's going to keep my child safe, then that's, you know, that's what I'm going to do. The new law requires all children under two years old to be buckled in a rear-facing car seat. According to the governor's traffic safety committee, car accidents are a leading cause of death for children ages 1 to 13. And the state says rear-facing car seats provide better protection. Keeping children safe and properly restrained is priority in New York State and therefore it's important for us to follow these new laws because they guarantee children to be transported in a much more safer way. But even without this new law, both Jessica and Alexis have already been planning ahead. My plan was always just to keep him rear facing as long as we could, um, as long as he was fitting in with the seat. Uh, specifications. If a child outgrows the car seat before their second birthday, parents are urged to upgrade to a convertible or all-in-one car seat with higher height and weight restrictions. In Syracuse, Adrian Smith, News Channel 9. Each child seat manufacturer will have different height and weight requirements. Parents and caretakers should double check the manual and learn the specific restrictions for their car seat. Coming up at